haven't been training this bonsai. It's getting too big. Oh, you should try knitting. It's very soothing. Unless you're knitting it for a baby that could be your husband's love child or your first grandchild. Angela, I'm so sorry. I wish I could just walk away. But that baby didn't have anything to do with how he or she got made. Are you expecting someone? It might be Amazon. I ordered some more of this soft yarn. They deliver late. Dennis. Hi. I know it's late. I couldn't sleep. I need to tell you something. OK, come in. Oh, hello. Hey. Good night. Uh, it's for you. Thank you. Yeah. You know, the uh, day you saved me literally brought me back to life on that autopsy table. All I planned to do was thank you. You did thank me. And I'm a doctor, Dennis, so you don't owe me anything. I know. It's, it's not that. It's, like it's my parents, they have the perfect marriage. I mean, 30 years, and they're still in love. They're soulmates. Why are you telling me this? I was so knocked over by you that, that I got afraid. And I jumped on a plane. I buried myself in work. I tried everything not to think about you. You did? Yeah, I did. I want what my parents have, and I never thought that I'd find it. But with you, it feels possible.